my hero throughout my life and part of the reason I moved to Barcelona was Cruyff. Yeah. Um, I was lucky enough to meet him and interview him. I did the last ever interview he did, which was a wonderful experience. And, and I was really arrested, uh, my attention was arrested by what he said about you before you left PSV Eindhoven because you, you were <laughs> winning the Cruyff Shield and you were title holder with PSV. Mm -hmm. But he talked about the way in which you defended meant that he actually came up with a famous quote about they could have Yapstan defending on his own. Yeah, I know, yeah. It, which was such a brilliant <laughs> phrase. For a guy, and for a guy like this, that wasn't just, there's some nice praise. With such a uh, strange brain as he had, I, I, I guess he almost meant it because he could envisage a team that played completely differently because of the skills you had. Yeah. When, what did it mean to you at the time? I guess too much media fuss. But when a guy like that talks about you, and what was he describing? Was, it was, it's just a funny thing. I was just like, <laughs> last, when was it, last week? My wife and I, we went into the basement. Well, not, you know, not to do funny stuff, but we went into the basement. <laughs> We went into the basement to uh, to clean up, basically, because all the all the moving houses we uh, we did. We all collect stuff, don't we? We, we, we collect, collect stuff. And, and, one, and stuff. one thing that I, I came through, I took a picture of it. Oh man! Was uh, oh, that is, was the picture that that is so beautiful that he gave that he gave to me, and that was taken after when he uh, when he gave me that trophy. You know, I had which a, I guess is the Cruyff Shield. It was yeah, it was the trophy becoming a best player in uh, in Holland. In Holland. And, and he, yeah, he gave me that, that trophy that time and he did that speech where you said like, okay, you know, you can have your upstamp on, your upstamp in defense all, all by himself. You will do it, basically. And that's, and, and, and Johan, uh, and I knew him afterwards a little bit better as well when I went to United and Jordi was there as well, his son. So I sometimes we went up to his house and then Johan was there as well with his wife and then family and we, we talk about football. He's, he's, um, he's a person that always, uh, thought about what he said, so everything he said, you know, was well thought of. He he understood it. So and and he understands football, and, and also and, and and that's why he said this as well, because he was all he also makes his comments out of the philosophy I think in how he wants to play. Yeah. Because at Barcelona as well, he wants to play good football a little bit in the Dutch way, what people are talking about now, but in the four three three attacking wise going forward. And then when you need to defend, you need to have players who can defend on like with big spaces in their backs. You know, to, to cover in 1v1s, etc. And that's what he likes as well.